So this is episode 11 of our journey to beat Roblox Bed Wars, where we go from level 0 to level 50 within the Battle Pass. And in the last episode, we're getting close to player level 15, which brings us into this episode where we have an update that directly affects the new series. We now have Evelyn Kick Contracts, Verification XP Bonus, AFK Coins and Shop, and more free kits of the week. So the first thing that caught my interest is what this AFK shop is about. You can now get an AFK crate for 4,000. And you get 1,200 AFK coins per hour. Well, I'm not going to be AFK for the next four hours right now. But speaking of lucky crates, we have a gold lucky crate to open. Because we are now player level 14. We're one player level from unlocking the Talia kit. But let's see what we get in our gold lucky crate. I mean, it's not the best, but it's not the worst. It's just a support kit. We're about to hit level 27 within the battle pass. So it's a perfect time for Evelyn contracts to come out. And we can only do the first three tiers. But in order to unlock the 10th tier, you need 1,500 kills, 20 dash kills, 300 dashes, and 150 wins. But most importantly, we need to own the kit. I haven't figured that out just yet. But the three kits for this week is Axolotl Amy, Evelyn, and Spirit Catcher. But for the first three tiers, we want to focus on the Evelyn contracts. First tier, you need three wins. But I want to maximize my player daily XP. So we're going to play squads and try and perform the best we can. We have no more Battle Pass XP boosters at the moment. So the new update directly affects the series. But not only just the series, the entirety of Bed Wars. You need to be careful because there's going to be players teleporting everywhere. Apart from a couple of sweats, of course, that don't care about the contracts. And also electric kits that are just on my case. But the first contract is pretty simple. We just need to win three times. I'm honestly quite happy that there's a new grind in the series for us to do. Those barbarian contracts were not fun. But we have an entire week of using Evelyn for free. Oh yeah, I forgot to check my missions. Let's get the dashes. Oh, there's no way he just put all of his diamonds in the chest. What was he thinking? He just put all of his diamonds right in the chest like that. The first win is going to be a pretty fast win. Because, uh, yeah, my teammates are breaking every single bed. Well, there's not much I can do about that. Well, at least we completed a mission. My teammates are just tryharded, so I may as well just go break the bed so I can get the XP. Instead of them getting the XP. Listen, the XP matters more to me. But as you guys can see, you only get an allowance of 5,000 daily XP. All right, so we got some new daily and weekly missions. We've already purchased everything that's important in the shop. But at least we're one step closer towards our gold lucky crate. I feel like the dash kills are going to be the hardest part. You don't always get the kill for it. <laughs> Oh, we have four diamonds. Let me go spend those. Let me go spend those. He's trying to go back to base for a reason. No one goes back to base for no reason. He had another four diamonds. <laughs> we are getting stacked. This is exactly what I like to see. Players just delivering me all the loot. Why is this uncaptured? What is this guy doing messing around with TNT? Is he just trying to glitch abuse or something? Right now, we just need to focus on one contract at a time. My teammate is coming straight over to their bed. There's not much I can really do about it. Let's get dashing around. Let's get our dashes up. Oh, there's a dash kill. Easiest way to do dash kills is just do it in their base. But it has a massive cooldown, so we got to wait. Teammates broke the bed. There's not much I can do about it. May as well just get the final kill. Oh, never mind. Oh, yeah, we got it. Well, the bad news is we've capped out on our daily XP limit, but we are one win away from unlocking our first tier, unlocking a mastery emote. People have been speedrunning wins in this game since day one. Why am I surprised? That's the first level 40 I've ever seen. So it's going to be the first level 40 I'm going to take out. He's, he's actually home teleporting as well. That's crazy. That was a pretty low IQ move from a level 40. Pearl around everywhere, complete all of my missions, and we're going to get a bunch of XP. Let's go get the boss, teammate. Just be careful where you fall. You guys know how it is. You just got to do what you got to do. I've already missed out on so much player level XP for getting tryhard teammates, so uh, I need to put a stop to them somehow. You might as well get the extra dashes in while you can. He's trying to yoink it with a bow. Nah, not happening. Not happening. I'm not allowing that. See, well, the good news is I'm Evelyn. So if they do try and fireball me, I could just save myself. And, if, you know, or if I get 3v1, just go behind them like that. <laughs> and then just go buy Diamond Armor at their base. And continue fighting the boss like nothing ever happened. And I say thank you very much and have a nice day. Dash damage. Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I figured it out now. I figured it out. 
Oh, not enough damage. Oh, teammates incoming. And he got knocked in the void by non-372. They're just so incapable of defending the bed. I'm going to have to go defend it for them, aren't I? Okay, all right. Never mind then. It's fine. You know, I won't defend your bed then. I won't defend your bed. I'll just drop you the obsidian then. You can have the obsidian if you want it that bad. Don't be blaming me when your bed gets taken out by my teammate, all right? I'm just trying to get some dash kills. I'm just trying to get some dash kills. All right, there's a couple dash kills there. Yeah, that's, that's what blocks at his head. <laughs> I was trying to spend some diamond. Oh, he's got the bed, yeah. Yeah, it's to be expected from a winged avatar. Well, at least I completed another mission. All right, we've unlocked the first two tiers, so we've now got an emote and an emote. How do I get it to face the right way? All right, now we need seven more wins. I know I said I wasn't going to speed run the wins, but uh, I don't want to play an extra two hours. So I'm just going to go get the rest of the wins in win streak 1v1. Do want to get this golden lucky crate by tonight. And as expected, we're against an Evelyn. I think everyone wants to go for the win regardless of being Evelyn kit. All right, what's the play? What's the play? What? <laughs> oh, no, don't build up on me. No way. No way he just jumped down on me like that. <laughs> What was he thinking? What is he doing? Why did he hesitate so bad? He's like, do I defend my bed or don't I defend my bed? He's gonna jump down onto me, but as if I didn't already know that. GG. <laughs> no way you just took full damage. You're gonna be low for the next seven years now. Boom. <laughs> you can save up for your armor. I'll take the emeralds. Wee. <laughs> This, this bait always works. I don't know why. It just does. They just think they're going to defend it, and then they just don't bother. And now they're just going to run away forever and ever and ever, and that's fine. You can run away forever and ever and ever and ever. You're not getting over to my bed unless you have blocks, and you don't have blocks because you spent it all on armor. Well, we may as well keep winning until our missions are done. Wee! <laughs> Oh, he did not know what to do there. He didn't expect that one, did he? He didn't expect that one. And now it's GG. He called me a no life. Well, that doesn't make sense because you're player level 36. <laughs> it's always the same looking avatars. Let me just pretend to put blocks around the bed like a bot. Whee! <laughs> We're just farming these level 36 tryhard clothing avatars. Like, what's going on? Why is the Rage Blaze showing above my head? I'm not even Barbarian. He's Barbarian. Barbarian this mode absolutely sucks because if I buy a Stone Sword, he's already undergeared. Looks like it's good for fast wins if you can outplay players, but if you don't know how to outplay players and you're the one being outplayed, then GG to you, I guess. Bye-bye. Boom! But for completing the third Evelyn contract, we have a gold lucky crate. So please give us something decent. Come on. Not bad. Actually, I'll take that. I've been running kind of low on the tickets, so I'll take it. So here's all the tickets I have left. We got some new emotes. We're getting very close to player level 15, which unlocks our next milestone kit being the Talia kit. And we're currently battle pass level 28, getting very close to 30 which will unlock the Cogsworth kit. So we're getting very close to unlock some good milestones. I just need to come up with a plan on how to obtain the Evelyn kit. If you guys have any ideas, let me know in the comments down below. Time to go AFK grind so I can figure out what these crates give. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And if anyone is new to the series or if you missed any episodes, here is the series playlist to keep up to date.